Hey guys, Silence Yell here. Welcome back to another Utah Necros Gacha video. We just had one um, two days ago, and now, well, technically yesterday, um, I was kind of busy, so I didn't record. But yesterday we had a uh, Min Mei's brand new seven star episode play drop upon us. So if you guys have yet to pull your gacha, uh, hopefully you guys have better luck with Min Mei's gacha as compared to Makinas. If you guys didn't get Makinas episode play. Um, with whatever seeing stones you have or if you were able to purchase um, seeing stones that I did mention in my very first Uta Micros Gacha video um, for the year. So let's talk about some of the other stuff that's currently going on. If you have not filled up this questionnaire form right here, you should. Technically, it will give you 250 singing stones for doing so and of course, you will let Dana know um, like what kind of improvements are you looking forward to um, if they were ever to implement certain things like maybe brand new characters that are not divas you know that kind of stuff and of course the Valkyrie animations the Valkyrie fighting sequences or maybe like whichever event you prefer you know and of course what kind of events you're looking forward to that kind of good stuff all right so let's talk about the discounted singing storm packs that just dropped upon us yesterday as uh, alongside with Min May's gacha as you can tell Dana is back with more discounted packs of course the usual 10,000 yen discounted pack is here as well um, this is the second round uh, apparently the first round happened before the year started and of course now there's only two days remaining before they disappear from the store if you guys have the finances for it uh go ahead and purchase them as like i usually recommend in all my past ultime across videos the 10,000 yen pack is definitely the most worthwhile but of course if you have the extra dough why not buy all three at one go that is if you are able to financially uh if not the 10,000 yen pack is more than enough but for me, I'm going to skip this time round because I don't tend to spend more than I can afford to. Um, so yeah, and aside from that, let's talk about the other stuff that was implemented recently in the last update into the game, which I never made an update video for because that was still the time period when I was on hiatus from Ultra time Cross content. So if you take a look at the, um, you know, the seasonal sphere store, all right, inside the store, there is this that is exchangeable right now. With 3,000 Winter Spheres, you can get a ticket that goes to the 5 star guaranteed episode plate service gacha. So yes, we are going to talk about that in a while. So let's go into the gacha page where we can see all the brand new gachas, um, you know, including Min Mei's and of course the uh, Christmas to New Year's 10 free episode plate gacha pool, which is what I have yet to do for today. And of course Min Mei's episode plate and of course Makinas if you have yet to get Makinas which, whichever diva you prefer you know if you like Min Mei the old school diva the old OG diva then of course if you prefer the Kawawa Basti Min, uh, Makina definitely go with Makina but of course if you are just a generic Utame cosplayer like myself um, definitely both 6 star or 7 star episode plates are definitely beneficial in the long run for the events in this month of January and of course, there is this one, which is the um, bingo gacha. As you can tell, I already have a piece of the ticket. So let's talk about that in a while. And of course, we'll have the guaranteed five-star episode plate gacha, which is, um, you know, uh, you, you can get the ticket for um, through the purchase of your singing stone spheres, that kind of stuff. So yeah, when you get the seasonal spheres, um, you can exchange for a guaranteed 5 star service gacha ticket uh, that is if you have 3000 of those spheres available to you and of course you have your ChoGQ gacha oh my goodness I have 25 tickets so there's a lot of gacha pools going to happen this episode as well and of course your daily uh, I get the pool my daily so let's um, do this after we talk about the bingo missions because like I said in the very first episode play or the very first update video for the month um, the bingo missions are kind of a problem if you guys don't know Japanese. So like I said, um, if you guys need help translation um, for any particular mission, you, you should by right be on second page right now, just like me. Uh, if you get to start any of the missions on second page, because one of the missions on the first page requires you to log in into Uta Macross continuously for three days. So right now it is the 3rd of January, so by right you should be on the second page. That is if you are not being hindered by any of the other missions as well. And of course, 
uh, if like like as always, if you guys need help for translations of um any missions, do screenshot the mission page. Then of course circle whichever mission that requires translation and post it on my YouTube Facebook page. I will have a page or rather I will have a post um that is asking you guys uh do you need translations on any of the missions at all let me know in the comment section of that post itself all right so let's dive back into the gacha page which is what this video is all about and let's start pulling all the nonsensical stuff that we can never afford to upgrade all the episode plates that they are giving us right now <laughs> yes they are giving us so many episode plates that the resources to upgrade the episode plates are just never enough nowadays especially the tiny white um, stones so let's do the free daily pool first uh, so just to wash out the bad luck that we we are currently having due to the good luck we had in the last video so let's try and flush things out okay flushing things out with all the free gachas is always a good thing so let's skip this because we know it will be bad apparently it's decent because i don't have this yet <laughs> it's new so, hmm, but I do have the costume unlocked, I think. Maybe not, hmm. I'll have to check, but then, again, you guys won't see it happen, so yeah. Okay, so we do have 25 um, Cho GQ gacha tickets. Um, you know, you usually you get this from the, um, uh, you know, the special pass that you are subscribed to monthly, if you guys are subscribed to. If not, you can exchange them to... Uh, with the red medals, you know, and some of the other stuff that you can exchange for. Um, so I'm going to use 20 of them. I, I usually pull by 10. So this is one of the good ways to flush out the bad luck as well. So you can keep the good luck with the main gachas. And if, of course, if you use up the good luck here, you know, there's always a chance of getting a 6-star or 7-star episode plate from this gacha pool. Okay, so we get some decent Valkyrie animations. Oh my goodness, we do have a rainbow box. So, oh my goodness, what in the world? No, I don't want all my luck here. Oh, you get loading. Do we get a... It evolves! It evolves! Holy crap! No, I want my good luck on the main main gacha. Oh, Kaname. Do I have Kaname's episode plate? I think this is new for me. Oh my goodness. No, why is the luck coming to this one? Okay, the red box doesn't evolve. Oh, we get a rare Macross 7 episode plate though. That's, that's cool. Uh-oh. Uh oh, it lagged a bit, so I thought it was going to evolve. Oh my goodness, what is with this luck? Oh my goodness, here we go. Oh no, it evolves again! What is with this luck? Okay, okay, we have this. We have this fully evolved now. I mean, it's unlocking all the, the, you know, the secret boards. Oh god, so many 6 star episode plates. Oh god, it lagged again. Oh god, it gave me a heart attack for a moment. I, might, I thought I was going to get like 3 6 star episode plates in one pool. Oh my goodness, Kaname is new. Kaname is new. So how many episode, how many, how many 7 star episode plate costumes am I lacking now? Okay, millions evolve. That's fine. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. And here I was just trying to flush out the luck. Oh no. Oh no. Does this mean I'm not going to get Min Mei's episode play at all? Oh no. Oh no. What a way to start the video. Oh boy. <laughs> oh, that is really unexpected. Really, really unexpected. Okay, we're going to go with another 10. This time around, we are definitely flushing away the luck. I mean, the bad luck. I don't think we're gonna get that kind of luck anymore. Oh no, it's loading again. Oh no. Please retain some luck for Min Mei's gacha. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, five Valkyries! Okay, it's a red box in a single blink. Okay, okay, the bad luck is coming. The bad luck is coming. So we got to flush out the bad luck. Oh god. What was it? The very first pool of 10 plates that was just surprising even for myself oh god okay Let's get rid of all the bad luck now okay oh it evolves to a five star uh oh what 
You can get birthday exclusive plates from this gacha? Oh, wow! And here I thought that birthday plates are unique to gachas for birthdays itself. Oh, that's, that's interesting. You know, but the new birthday plates are very specific for, you know, the particular diva. But apparently this one is the old version. Because um, the newer ones, they don't allow any other diva except for the person who's celebrating the birthday to equip that birthday plate. So that's pretty nice. That is the old one that I don't have. So, a lot of good stuff, but yet, like I said, um, there are so many plates being thrown at us now that I don't have enough resources to power them up. Alright, so I do have a ticket for the 5-star guarantee bingo um, gacha, so because I already completed the first page of the bingo missions, it gave me a ticket. So, I guess there's going to be 3 tickets in total because there are 3 pages, so every page to complete. Uh, it gives you one ticket, so that's that's pretty wonderful. So you'll be getting three five star episode plates. Um, of course, we don't know which one is the, the the best out of the four, but still having any five star episode plate is wonderful. Even if you have fully evolved them, I think getting the secret bot unlocked is actually pretty good. Um, especially if the episode plate is very useful. So yeah, we don't expect to see any more evolution of this. Oh my, Maki Maki. Oh my. <laughs> I'm happy because I, I'm I'm pretty I'm a pretty big fan of uh Nishida Nozomi. Uh, not exactly Makina, but you know uh, Makina Seiyu is uh, what I'm fan of. So you know getting a bit of Maki Maki love is fine. Uh, does this episode play Oh it does come with the score so yes getting this episode play is definitely very good because it's one of the better high score achieving episode plates. Uh, once I can get it to a plus 5 value, I'm definitely going to power up to have a Kira Kira fight, you know, that kind of thing. So, oh, that's a pretty good pool. <laughs> okay, so Makina is definitely one of the better episode plates you can get from that gacha. Um, Alright, so let's move along with another free gacha before we touch the paid ones because, oh god, we, we had all our luck, you know, drain out just from that Chojikyu gacha. Oh god, okay, let's flush out more bad luck with this free template gacha. Uh, if if this one ends up lucky as well, I, I, I don't know what is going to happen with Ninmei's gacha pool. Oh god. Was there loading? I, I didn't see any loading. I was rubbing my eyes because I was so depressed. <laughs> I mean, it's a good depression, but still. Um, okay. Okay, lousy Valkyrie animation, that's fine. It means the backlight is still here. Hopefully we win this pool. Oh god, there's a rainbow box! There's two rainbow boxes! No! No! I mean, it's good, but yet no! I want the new stuff as well! Oh, come on! You know... It's, it's good, I'm happy, but yet I'm, I'm, I'm conflicted. Oh god. What's with this gacha video? Oh god, it lags a bit. Okay, it did not evolve. Oh, we get me Mei's New Year costume episode plate. That's fine. That's, that's really into the season. Yeah. Okay, no evolution for the red box. Okay. Okay, here we go. The last rainbow. So no evolution for this one. We get a power up for Freya's God Bless You episode plate, which I already have fully evolved. So yeah. So, okay, that's fine. Oh, the base plate evolves. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. Okay, good stuff, good stuff. Okay, okay. Here we go. I don't know. Min Mei's gacha is gonna look very horrible. Guys, I'm sorry if we had have to end it on a very horrible note, but, you know, with all the luck we've seen just from all the other random gacha pools that we did, I don't think Min Mei's gacha pool is going to end up very good, but let's go for it. As you can tell, I've already done my free single pool, and it wasn't fantastic because I was planning to flush out the luck, and apparently when I flushed out that luck, today, we started off fantastic, so... <laughs> oh god, if we do end with Min Mei's plate coming out, this video is by far the luckiest I've ever done in any of my 3 years content of Ultra Macross Gacha videos, we constantly had good luck in one single video. That is never, that has never happened before. 
So guys, here we go. Don't expect good things. I mean, we've already seen so many wonderful pools just from the beginning and the middle portion of this video. I, I, I can't expect it to end on a wonderful note as well. But if it does, oh god, this is... If it does end on a very good note, you must, you must leave a like on this video. Oh god, that's loading. Oh god, oh god, oh god. I, my heart can't take it. My heart can't take it. Come on, let's go. Three Valkyries. No 4-5, but there is always a chance. Come on. Oh, we get a rainbow box. Okay. Okay, there is a chance. There is a chance. No evolution on the first red box. So there is a chance. There is a chance that might give us Min Mei. You know, or even an older episode play of a, a 6 star or 7 star. You know. Okay. Oh, here we go. No evolution on this one. Oh, we get a lot of Min Mei love. Oh, it, is, it is the new year and it's, you know, Min Mei's gacha. So, you know, Min Mei love. You know, there is one more red box that might evolve. You know, I, 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 I emphasize on the might. Okay, here we go. Alright, lots of Min Mei love. So, no evolution. Okay. So, we ended on a pretty decent note at least. At least we did get a rainbow box. So, that's not too bad. You know, but sadly to say, I don't have enough singing stones. And of course, the neighbor is doing constructions while I'm recording videos. So yeah, like I said, uh, um, you know, we ended on a decent note. It didn't become an extremely fantastic video, but it was fantastic nonetheless. I mean, I mean, it's not extremely fantastic, but fantastic nonetheless. Oh god, what do you guys get for yourselves in all the free pools and all the other free stuff that you've recently gotten thanks to the Christmas and New Year celebration uh, of Uta Macross? Do you guys get more wonderful stuff than me? Let me know in the comment section down below. And of course, uh, Min Mei's, you know, 7 star episode plate, just like all the 7 star episode plates out there, it doesn't come with any special notes attached to them if you actually go and tap the, the information for the episode plate. But it is definitely a more powerful version of Min Mei's past 7 star episode plate. So if you guys are Min Mei fans, definitely you will want to try and obtain yourself a copy of the current 7 star for Min Mei. Uh, of course, it unlocks the costume, but at the same time, it provides you with a more pow powerful alternative for Min Mei's collection. Anyway guys, thank you guys so much for joining me on another episode of Uta Macross Gacha video. Let me know in the comments section down below. Uh, as always, what do you guys think of the episode plates? What do you guys pull for your episode plates? What do you guys need help with in the mission bingo? And of course, um, you know, if you guys have a good year, let me know as well. And I'll see you guys in the next Uta Macross Gacha video. Until then, I'll see you guys soon. Bye!